First, another child is found in a backyard pool, this time a three-year-old little boy in Phoenix. Thanks for joining us, everybody. I'm Lindsay Reiser. And I'm Jason Berry. Let's get right to Maria Hechenova, who is covering this heartbreaking story near Tatum and Union Hills. Maria, what can you tell us? I just got the update from Phoenix police. They tell me that little boy has died. We're talking about a three year old found in this pool, uh, this backyard pool at this home off of Bluefield Avenue. Uh, his grandparents found him there and here's what we know. We watched several Phoenix police officers go in and out of here the last few hours. Uh, Phoenix Fire tells me they received the drowning call just after 1 p.m. When they arrived on scene, the boy was already out of the water and police had started CPR. Paramedics took over, but it didn't look good. The boy did not have a pulse and was not breathing the entire time he was in Phoenix Fire's care. And he arrived at the hospital in bad shape. One of the neighbors heard the sirens and saw this when he went outside. They put him on a you know, stretcher and they took him right out to the ambulance. And, um, you know, I, I'm, I went inside and prayed that, the, that he would make it. Now that same neighbor tells us the boy, uh, the pool the boy was found in did not have a backyard pool fence. Phoenix police tell me they won't know if charges will be filed until the investigation is complete. Again, Phoenix police now gone from this home. Uh, this makes four children who have died in the valley in a backyard in a pool over the last two weeks. So again, just tragic, heartbreaking news to tell you guys tonight. Reporting live in Phoenix, Maria Hachinova, back to you.